The reverse pivot shift test is used to assess the integrity of the PCL or posterior cruciate ligament of the knee. The patient should be relaxed in a supine position with the hip and knee placed in 80 to 90 degrees of flexion. The examiner will support the patient's leg and rotate the tibia into external rotation. Maintain this external rotation and apply a valgus force to the knee. Posterior subluxation of the tibia may occur in this position if the patient's PCL is compromised. The examiner continues the test by extending the knee, maintaining a valgus and external rotation force to the tibia. This test test is considered positive if the tibia is subluxed posteriorly at the starting position when the knee is flexed but reduces back into place anteriorly while extending the knee through a small range, usually around 30 degrees of flexion. A clunk may be felt by the examiner and the patient as the knee is moved into extension. However, this is usually uncomfortable for the patient and may result in guarding or apprehension. For more information about the reverse pivot shift test and other special tests, visit ptprogress.com test. Hey, if you found this video to be helpful and to the point, can you give it a like below? It really helps the channel so we can make more videos like this for you. And I'd love for you to subscribe and to join the community. So hit the subscribe button and we'll see you in the next video.